it's Megan from Smart Kids Piano, and today I'm going to show you how to play Roar. All right, here's the part we'll learn in part one. Alright, so you might have noticed I didn't really use very many keys to play that song. It's mostly G, A, and C, and then there's a couple of D's and E's in there. So let's have our hands in middle C position where our thumbs are sharing C. Our right hand has C, D, E, F, and G. Our left hand moving backwards has C, and then B, A, G, and F. So for the whole song, your left hand is only going to need the G and the A. And this is a really good song to sing the lyrics in your head or out loud as you go because it's really the same notes over and over so it'll just kind of help you keep track of how many times you've played it. So let's start with the part. Um, it's We're starting with I've got the eye of the tiger. I've got the eye of the tiger, a fighter. Okay, so you can see right there I just had G, A, and C. And a lot of times when we play the C we hold it a little longer. Watch that again. I've got the eye of a tiger, a fighter. Do you wanna to try to play that with me? Let's do it again. So we start on our G. That's it. Yeah, and then we kind of keep going with similar notes. Dancing through the fire, cause I am the so we had two C's at the beginning of that. Dancing through the fire, cause I am the champion. That's it, play that with me. And then, and you're gonna hear me roar. So that part is the only time we play um, D and E in the right hand. Yeah, can you play that with me? That's it. All right, so let's put together everything we know so far. See if you can keep up. It's kind of similar. We're going to keep doing similar things, just a little bit different this time. Louder, louder than a lion, cause I am a champion, and you're gonna hear me roar. See, and that one just stays on a G at the end. Alright, so here's the part where it says louder. Louder, louder than a lion, cause I That's it. All right, so let's see if we can put all of that together. That is all of part one, so see if you can play along. Yeah, that's a really fun one to play. All right, so practice that and make sure you can do that without having to stop or without having to think too hard about it. And then join me in part two when you're ready and I'll show you the rest of it. Have fun practicing. Hey, it's Megan, your piano teacher. I have a lot of fun teaching you piano lessons and don't forget that you kind of have to go slow sometimes. You won't learn how to play the piano really quickly overnight. You just have to take your time and do your best and it'll come with time. So have fun practicing.